Alrighty, YouTubers, how to get the control panel off this GE um, washer. It doesn't have your typical setup where there's screws behind the panel here and here, or there's nothing here to get to to help you get it off. The key to getting it off is take your dispenser drawer out, push the tab down that's in there, and the drawer will come out. Take out these two screws. These two pieces snap into place into the control panel. Pull this knob off then pull this knob off. It will expose this screw. It's a hex screw. It goes right in there. Once the hex screw is out, this will kind of pop up out of place. It just kind of has a couple of snaps back there and uh, it comes off. Obviously now you can get the top off and go on to whatever it is you need to fix. Thanks for watching. Pedestal base front cover. Three screws. One, two, three. And then it will slip to the left. Like that and lift off. Now you can get the front cover off, which you've got your screws up top one, two, three, and four. Now I'm assuming that if I get these off, I can take the front off. The front panel, there was a fourth screw inside the drain access port that came off, and then it came, the whole front came off. Um, this thing has a bad bearing, not worth repairing. Uh, the model number is GFWR2700H0WW. Um, hope the video helps you in terms of disassembly. Thanks for watching.